Hey guys and gals, it's Cassie from Elementor. In this video, I'll go over the Elementor 2.0 single post template. So what is a single post template anyway? When you use a theme for your site, you get your themes post template. It's made out of different elements, a post title, which is the title of your post, and post content, which is the content of your post. A featured image, metadata, comments, you catch the drift. Designing a theme single post template requires a whole lot of coding. Here comes Elementor's 2.0 single post template, giving you the freedom to edit the layout and design of your single post template on any theme. So whenever you hit that old Add New Post button, it'll automatically have the layout and design you set up in the template. So let's see how it's done. From the WordPress dashboard, Elementor, Templates, Add New Single, choose Post, click on Create New Template. Here you can choose a block and insert it, or create a new one from scratch. We'll use a block and insert it. So what is a single post template made of? Let's look at an example. On the top is a featured image. If you don't have a featured image in your post, you're going to see a gray area here. The gray area is a placeholder for dynamic content. Let's move on. Here you see the author box. Just below it, you see the post title. Here's the metadata, meaning the date, time, tag, category, etc. Here we can see the gray area, meaning we have some dynamic content that is missing from our post. In this case, it's the post excerpt. Don't worry, your site visitor will not see a gray box. It's just meant for you as the admin of the website. So you'll know the dynamic content is missing from that specific post. Now we see the post content area. This is where all your post content, text, images, etc., will be displayed. Then onto the share buttons an important addition to any post. When finishing up our single post template, you'll see the comments section. The block we inserted uses the Facebook comments widget, but we can edit and make changes to our template. So we'll use the WordPress built-in comments instead. Come on, let's change it together. Delete the Facebook comments widget, search for the post comments widget, and drag it in just below the socials, here. Now we have our comments area. After going over the different parts that make up the single post template, let's preview it in a different post. Click the eye icon, Settings, and under Preview Dynamic Content As, choose Post, and start typing a post title. I know I have one about breakfast. Let's have a look. And here's another one about my trip to Italy. Che bello! Now we see our post previewed in a fresh layout and design. You know what? I'd rather have the featured image under our post title. Let's swap it. Just drag the title above the image. And there we have it. Publish. Don't forget to add conditions. You can apply it to all posts or by category. Let's choose all posts and create a new post together. Go to Post. Add new post, give it a title, some content, paste some lorem ipsum text here, add a featured image, and let's preview our post. Fantabulous! It has our layout and design. So you see, it's easy peasy to create your own single post template however you like. Explore the panel where you'll find more cool dynamic widgets that'll help you further design your single post template. I really hope to see what kinds of designs you come up with for your single post template. Share it in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Don't you dare close the tab before subscribing to our YouTube channel.